and today I get to bring you along for a little bit of a review. And I, I don't do these very often, but um, I was asked to do this and I agreed that I would try these and I definitely want to give you my opinion. So, um, and I have struggled with avocados my whole life <laughs> and, and slicing eggs up for um, uh, like say a spinach salad. So this could be the solution plus um, slicing strawberries. So this is um, a little slicer that I think you're going to like. Um, I got to use it a couple of times already and then this over here you can slice either an egg or strawberries on it and then we have an avocado uh, multi-tool actually and this whole thing these two things together are called a vegetable slicer fruit and vegetable slicer so the avocado actually avocado um, tool actually has a plastic blade here to cut the avocado and then in here you can remove the seed and you go hmm that doesn't look like it's going to work but it, it, trust me when I tell you I'm going to show you up close and then to slice it right in its half you've got this end of the slicer so let me bring you in close so you can see firsthand and make a honest decision on your own and I'll give you my opinion and um, I'll also leave a link where you can go get these two things in, uh, in a bundle and, you know, make your life easier because I'll tell you what, not struggling with an avocado or slicing eggs is just fabulous. <laughs> okay, let's come on in and see how these little gadgets work. Okay, so let's see what we've got here. Let's do our, uh, this dual slicer and or um, actually for like, uh, let's say potato salad, if you like putting eggs in your potato salad, check this out. This is pretty cool. Set your egg just like that, holds it right in place and center this little doohickey the correct way and just down it goes. And it helps if you have it lined up right, there we go. So you're lined up and your egg is totally cut for you in pieces just like that to go to, to go in a chef salad or let's say I just think they're perfect and you don't have any crumbly yolk going on so I don't know about you but I think that's pretty darn fabulous and then over here uh, let's go ahead and slice the strawberry first so we don't uh, have a egg flavored strawberry I don't know how good that would be and these strawberries are first of the season, so they're real firm. And you just, same thing. And these are like wires like um, a cheese cutter might have. And you slice right through. And this one's giving me a little bit more trouble. But I think because how ripe or not ripe these are, look at that. And how pretty is that? All fanned out. In fact, I used this on my husband's breakfast plate this morning and he was thoroughly impressed. He goes, how did you do that so perfect? Okay, so now we're gonna have, let me wipe off the, I'm not um, super picky about uh, whether the egg has a little bit of strawberry or not, it'll be okay. So you put your egg in there and just like the other one. Oh my gosh. And so have you guys ever had um, a chef salad or an egg, um, um, a spinach salad where you've sliced the eggs and you get that yolk business all over the place? Well, here you go. Problem solved. Now that is perfect. There we go. Check that out. Okay, let's move this all over here so we can, let's see what the avocado tool is gonna be like. Okay, and I'm gonna tell you that this avocado is extremely firm. I just got these yesterday, but I promised this video to come out by Tuesday. So um, I, I, I gotta keep my word. So the knife, honestly, it just goes right in and it's the perfect, um, little lengths to get down to the seed. And what's nice about this, I think, is it's kid friendly. 
you're, you're not going to cut yourself with that. So let's say your child wants an avocado and they're uh, a little leery about um, cutting one with a knife or you don't want them to, problem solved. Okay, let's go ahead and take the pit out. Now you guys all know how hard it is to do this. So you just really smack down and turn this and there you go. Bam. <laughs> I love it. Okay, we'll get rid of that. And you, and you don't risk, you know, because a lot of times I would whack that knife down on it and you don't risk cutting yourself or teaching your kids bad habits. So as you can see, um, it's not the same day. I went to do some editing on this video and for no apparent reason, my microphone kept fading in and out and it's very hard to hear me during the um, slicing of the avocado. So I thought I would just go ahead, it's the next day, we're going to finish this up because I promised to have this video out today. And so um, you're on this, to this end of the tool is the slicing. And so you just push that in and again this avocado is pretty ripe. And you're following along the edge of where the um, skin is. And at the end of that video is where I wanted to give my opinion on how I like these items. I absolutely love the avocado slice, slicer, the uh, pit, and the knife end. This is a great product. The other one, I, I, I like it because um, I can get those perfect slices, but I'd like to see it a little bit heavier duty, if that makes sense. So, guys, I hope this inspires you to go ahead and check it out. I'll leave a link to where you can get those items. Um, check it out and uh, make your own decision based on what I've shown you today. And I apologize that the video is broken up, but that's what we got. So you can't go back and redo it unless you go back and redo it. Hmm. <laughs> anyway, as always, I can't wait to see you next time for another delicious recipe, perfectly sliced avocado. Look at that. I mean, it really does do a nice job. And every morning on my husband's sandwich, when I make a sandwich for his lunch, one side instead of a condiment is a sliced avocado. So I buy them at Costco every week and we eat avocados daily. So this really makes my life much easier. All right, I can't wait to see you next time for another delicious recipe. And uh, go ahead and if you're not a subscriber, hit subscribe. Okay, bye.